Hey everybody, welcome back to Scourge Ringer. I'm Odia Baranis. Today I'm going to be showing you how I can beat the Judge Bodybuilder, the boss of the very first area here. We struggled against him last time. I've faced him a couple times since then. I think I'm ready to take him on though. We'll give our best, best bet. It's going to depend a little bit on the loadout I get while we play through this again. Um, I'm going to start at the beginning though. This doesn't seem fair to just like start at the Bodybuilder. And I got to get to the Bodybuilder without taking too much damage too. Yeah, sometimes it's better than others. I mean, like, I can I can do this. I think we can do this. So, I've, I've gotten a little more offensive with my attacks here now. A little more used to being very direct and everything here. Don't, don't let up. Don't give them any space. They're about to attack. Attack them back. All that stuff. If they're too far away, shoot them. And just never stop. Just never stop. I also like to start attacking guys before they even pop out of the, the out of their little animation there to start in the, the round level. And that helps truly really helps my combo go up, which makes I get more money by doing that too. Nice. Like that. Use the gun as a last resort to finish guys off that are out of my range. Especially when I'm in the air like this. And I can't get to them. Ooh, and first damage of the round. Second damage. Second damage of the round. Not too bad, though. Uh, let's get back up to here. This will be the merchant. Free room, basically. Uh, not enough money to really buy anything, but I do have an increased max HP by one here waiting for me. I'll probably be able to afford all of those by the end of the... Uh, not all of them, but most of them by the end of the thing here. Out of ammo. That guy's about to attack, so I'm gonna get out of the way. Oh, I barely sneaked by there. Max HP by one, thank you very much. If I can have 10 go into the boss, I'll be okay. Ooh, just barely dodged that one. Oh, God. Nice. I don't know how I avoided damage there, but I somehow did it. All right, let's get ourselves an upgrade here. Blessing of sorts. What do we got? We got uh, drop any kind of items, randomly drop weapons when finishing a room, or enemies are stunned for more time. I think I'm going to do random weapons. Seems to help me a lot. Ooh, that guy. This guy snuck one in there. Nice. Relentless, right? You just feel like a badass in this game, honestly. Like, you just like get these combos together that are just like sick, and you're like, ah, oh, no one can do that but me. But it's like, yeah, everybody can do that. Just button mashing. But it's like hard to explain, like the minute to minute strategy here. As long as you get the job done, it's like just keep slamming buttons together and like go with what the like, impulse, like, like, like that. Like, that's my almost full health again. If I get full health going to the boss, I'll be okay. I learned a lot facing him so far here. This guy's giving me some trouble here. Oh boy. Okay. Nice. Oh my god. Again, just being able to avoid that damage like the crazy is is that's good stuff. Okay, here's our boss. Ooh. Not this guy though. Yeah, this guy's no problem for me anymore. My damage isn't even that great. It's just like, I am just know how to be relentless on that guy now. Like one round of damage and that's all I need. Okay, so that takes care of that. Let's get done over here. Maybe get one more heal if I can. Maybe. One more life up. that guy's gonna fire okay. oh really i usually don't get by those guys machine gun all right let's take it i usually i don't know i don't fight the, the boss with the machine gun ever i mean it's pretty cool
I mean, it's really cool. And more damage. This is going to be good, actually. I got a lot of damage on the gun now. And that's everything. Let's go back to this guy here. I love how fast you can teleport. Um, max HP up. Sword damage up. And switch to the shotgun. Not enough money. That's okay. I have the machine gun. I'm okay with that. All right. We're into the boss room then. All right, here we go. Judge Bodybuilder, as promised. Let's do it. I love how fast this game goes. Okay, so there's a couple moves this guy does. He does this move. I don't want to get out of the way. You wait for him to go and then, then dash. He's got this move here. It's clap move. Just can avoid that one pretty easily. And he's going to do this again. Oh, just bad damage there. Ooh, just barely moved that one up. So when he gets to the side, he's always going to do that. So you know we can kind of predict what he's going to do there. He's going to do his another fist attack. Now he's going to do this. And I can actually hit him, stun him with that. Now he's got that move. Oh, I hate that move. You're still doing okay. He's going to kind of pay attention to where, where the drops are there. This one's not too bad. Oh, I didn't mean to dash that direction though. Now his, now his attack does that, which isn't great. Oh boy, okay. Got him, nice. And that is how you beat Judge Bodybuilder. Like, do that, just do that. Um, It gets really hectic there, I can't even explain what I'm doing, but I can clearly do it now. It ain't so bad now. I think I've beaten him twice, total, ever. So that's something. Now, still Bastion, I have almost no experience with this area. So it'll be interesting. It's, it looks it looks cool. It's like all icy and stuff and snowing in the background, but the enemies here are new. And so I don't know what to expect from them. I'm just gonna shoot him from afar. And he's got like laser weapons. I don't know how to avoid that. I just wait for him to attack. They have a lot more health, too. Ooh. I don't want to see what that guy does. It's like a shotgun. Alright. I think I got the gist of them now. Ooh, a mini boss. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. This is fun. Oh, I don't want to be down here with this guy. <sighs> that was that was hectic. But we got him the first try, which is nice. Gives back some HP. Okay, cool. Those things just die. Oof. I lost two HP there already. Oh, I don't know what these things do, but I don't like it. There we go. Um, those those little like diamond things, I don't really like them. They uh they seem to be bad if you have a lot of range. Like a lot of distance is bad with those guys. Killing those guys fast is important. Get out of the way of that. Oh, okay. Ooh, didn't mean to do that. Yes, shoot him from afar. That's probably the safest way to deal with that. All right. Ooh, damn, why did I take damage from that? What is this thing? Oh my God. <gasps> that jerk. That's nice. Nice. Okay. Not doing great here. We have the shop up here, though, which is nice. I have like 800 bucks to spend. Oh, if I can't. It's, it's so easy to jump in this game. Explore what I want to. Gives back an HP. Uh, this is what I have already. So let's get this for sure. Let's get that for sure. All right. We're down to three HP. What we got here? 
new blessing. So uh, maximum combo multiplier goes up to 3.0 and can't go below 1.5 when hit, okay? Uh, reloading energy and reveals greed's position on the map every round. Let's go with this one. Three times multiplier. Give us a lot of money. All right, that's open. I don't want to fight the boss for this one too. We need more health if we're gonna do this. All right, one down. Oof. Oh God, stunned, that's good, that's great. I downed two though still. All right, here we go. Here goes nothing. And some health back. Yes. Need it. Badly. Alright, that's not too bad. Oh, that laser blast! Oh, dang it. Wow. Alright. Well, that was something. Attempt 11. See, I haven't played this too much, but uh, yeah, that judge was uh, was challenging. Now we gotta start all over again. But I got a lot of upgrades again, so we'll spend some money on those. I got five this time around. We can get, uh, let's see, this is combo breaks 25% slower when there's no enemy around. It please stop, stop close to shops or altars. Okay. It allows throw bullets back at enemies with the smash, inflicting a lot of damage impact. I love that. Accumulation accumulated blood crystallizes into judge blood when going back to the tree for being knocked out. One for a thousand. Eh. Let's get this guy. Alright, let's try another run here. Um yeah. We can get this judge down again. I can I can explain a little bit better than two what I was doing against him. Maybe. This area is gonna be no problem coming up pretty soon now. Well, I'm excited to use my smash attack on the uh, the judge too, if that works. Like this, if the smash deflects bullets back at him, that'll make it way easier. Nice. Nice. See, I tried to deflect those back. I love the idea of deflecting them back, but it's actually tough to aim. Nice. We're getting it. We're getting it. Smash this dude. Keep the stun. Watch out for that guy over there. Those little suckers on the, the sides there, they always like sneak up on me a little bit. I just gotta pay attention to them. And I've been trying to. Well, that did a lot of damage, yeah. If I get the angle right on it. Oh, that was, that was, is a lot of damage, I love it. I love how fast you kill things in this game. It's so it's so quick. Like you got an extra ten seconds. Play this game for like a while. Like you can you can just play like four or five rooms in less than a minute. Like I finished I finished the judge. We were like what five minutes into the episode. Most of my episode was spent on uh, the second area. Maybe I'm playing it way faster than I should I'm supposed to. But I don't know. This is the way it's working for me. It's, it's pretty amazing. 
like like I said, you just feel cool. <laughs> It's kind of like like in Batman Arkham Asylum when you finally get like the long string of combos together and like really like beat up everyone you meet. It's like it has that feeling where you just feel like, oh man, that was badass. Getting hit by spikes though, not great. I hate these things when they're on all four sides like this. Nice. Okay, we have uh, gives back two HP. Need it and increases damage and stun enemies. Sure. Oh, not enough money yet. Almost enough money. We beat this guy already. I wanted to deflect that, and I kind of blew it trying to do something fancy there. Got 1.5 bonus there. I think 1.6 is as high as it goes. We got a blessing for grants 0.5 invulnerability after successfully deflecting bullets back with smash. More damage for missing HP. I don't think so. And more likely to drop any kind of items. I like that better. Okay, let's go over to this room. And we'll buy that. And then we'll go over to this room. Kill this guy. <laughs> That's not even a challenge anymore. That dude just dies so quickly. He has some nice upgrades for killing him too, but damn. That was, that was, I feel bad for him. All right, let's see how fast we can beat this guy now. Bodybuilder. that that worked nicely i don't think i took any damage there that time around oh my god that's awesome and do i want to go back and buy anything from this dude that we had the machine gun right for 8350 also that a shotgun a straight shotgun precise shotgun with very limited spread hmm it's plus one damage but my ammo is gonna be down to four or five. Eh, let's leave it. Let's not go for it. Let's get out of here. I like it. All right. That was up to 1.8 multiplier there too, which is nice. Now with the deflection on these things, it's gonna be amazing actually. I don't need to deflect, but still. Hey, bud. Um, 350, huh? Sword damage up. Power pack. And then the shotgun again. Okay. And a blessing right away. Nice. Damn, this is going to be a decent run here. So each enemy killed while not touching the ground. Hydra gains 10% sword damage. Oh, Walverin is loud. I love that. Because I'm in the air constantly. That's great. Each enemy kill gives me a 10% bonus. Is that what it's saying? In the air. If I kill enemies without touching the ground. Which sword damage, not gun damage. Oh, really? Nice. 
I love the deflection on those things that just like give me softballs and back it up. Oh, that guy's this guy's impossible. Nice. <laughs> All right. I'm having some fun with this run here. So far, so good. <laughs> Not even hit once there. Increases combo by 0.5. Oh my god. Oh, that worked okay. Oh, it's gonna be full of bullets here in a second. All softballs. Love that I can deflect now. It's so cool. I love that. I love that so much. The deflection is my favorite thing. That's so good. so good. I love it. What is that guy? Oh, he's dead. Whatever he is. Nice. My health back up. We're doing pretty good here. This guy got to take care of quickly. Nice. Exactly what I had in mind. I don't think I hit the ground there at all once I got started. Now I'm on the ground. I love this so much. It's got that bullet hell flavor to it, like, but it's like in such short doses. Like it happens, like, it's like, it reminds me of Enter the Gungeon, honestly. As far as like the bullet hell dodging of it, so it's like so much fast pace than that is. Oh, well, I wanted to just blast that back of these guys. There we go. Just wanted it. Regardless of how much it would have not helped me to do so. More damage from a gun. Love it. All right. And now we can head back over to here. You can't deflect that guy. From the cloning on deflections. Okay, why can't I do this? Nice. Alright. Now we're back this way. I was hoping to stun him, though, as part of it. Like, even the deflections, um... If they can't happen with those guys, that's gonna stun him at least. Like that. That was the hope there. More damage? Yeah! And more health. Anywhere else? Alright, let's talk to him and see if there's anything else I can buy. Shotgun. Again, it's a short-range, standard shotgun. Four ammo plus one damage, it looks like. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I have so much money. All right. We're going to the, we're onto the boss this area then. I dare say we're not going to have enough health to beat it, but we'll see what happens. K. 
candle man. What is this? Ooh, I gotta avoid that now. Any deflection on that is gonna be pretty good. Like this part right here. Deflection saves the day again. again. Oh, I got him. Nice. Oh, it's awesome. More damage, more blast damage. Oof, that's good stuff. That's so good. On the next area. I love it. The wasted pit. Oh man. Start attacking things. Don't care what they do. Oh, damn. There's some big deflections I could do in this now. My this is a mini boss. Oh, God. That works. That works okay. Ooh, that's bad. Almost dead. Oh, I jumped right in like the swamp gases, whatever that is. Stagnant fumes. I died by stagnant fumes. Oh, man. This game, guys, it is awesome. I hope you'll enjoy this look at it. Uh, man, it's good stuff. It's getting easier and easier the more we play, too. And now we have 10 to spend. Our upgrades are going to be massive here. Uh, striking smash, smash enemies are projected towards other enemies, inflicting more damage. Yes, I love that. Smashing an item from greed will transmute it into another random item. Uh, maybe. And then crystallized mutation. I could have actually gotten more out of that if I had this first. I have seven to spend. Uh, allows perform fury to recharge over time. Destroys all enemy projectiles. Ooh, that's nice. I dig that. It'd be nice if it deflected all enemy projectiles. We're trying this. All right. Well, that's... That's awesome. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. We're 41% complete with the tree here already. And then it's just into like speed runs or something like that. I have no idea what we do after we complete the tree. But it's good stuff. Thank you so much for watching this episode. And I'll be back for uh, another adventure next time.